Hillary Clinton's pitch to millennial voters. Free college tuition for families making up to $125,000 a year. That's for in-state public colleges or universities. The National Review's Kat Timpf is with us. She looks like a millennial to me. I'm not going to ask directly, but she looks like I a sure millennial. I am. And that is an extraordinary pitch to millennials, which surely is a vote-getter, isn't it? Of course it is. They'll say, I want free college. Right. Of course, it's wishful thinking. It's really not that simple, and we're talking about hundreds of billions of dollars. Uh, but the Democrats have been very successful in saying, well, you know, that's not true. Other countries do it, this and that. The Republicans just don't want you to have it because they're mean. No, you know, Germany, 2013, 2.7 billion students. U.S. that same year, 20 or million, 20 million students. I mean, that's a little bit of a difference. There's going to be even more if it's free. How are we going to pay for that? But what about those people who are making, say, $125,000 a year for the household, and they're living in a major city with a big tax base? They're not rich. At 125 grand, you're not rich. Absolutely, and it's the same standard for someone if, who's living in, say, New York City, as someone who's living, you know, in the Midwest somewhere, or someone who's living in the. It is very different everywhere. Are you making that amount of money, for example, here, you're definitely not rich. No, you're not. You're definitely <laughs> you're not. Definitely not. What about the idea that along comes as we get closer to the election? A pitch from Hillary Clinton for student loan forgiveness. Mm -hmm. Surely that is a likely on the cards deal, isn't it? I I'm sure it but is. I don't know for sure, but it sounds like a very attractive well, offer if she made it. Here's what you can do is you can say, hey, I'm going to give you this, and then people vote for you, and then if it doesn't work out, you say, well, the Republicans stopped it. <laughs> I mean, she can say whatever she wants now, but she's not going to have the kind of power to do these things in the first place, guaranteed, especially because if you look at the actual numbers, it's going to be really difficult difficult to make something like this work without really hurting another area of the economy. Yes, I mean, how much is this thing going to cost? For right, sake? absolutely. I, I don't know, and I don't think she does either. Mm -hmm. Kat Timp, everyone, thank you very much indeed. It was exactly. a brief appearance, but it's a but big it's news It's so day. good to be back. Is yes. it? Really? Yes. All right, you can come <laughs> back again. Thanks. <laughs> how about